Philippines has claimed to have agreed to buy the amphibious amphibious armored combat earthmover, OS, made by Turkish FNSS. The statement came from the Director General of Turkey's FNSS defense system, Nail Kurt, to Anadolu Agency in an interview on Monday, February 10. Details of the agreement will be completed in the next two months, and vehicle shipments will begin in 2021. He added that a new contract could be signed with the Philippines to import other FNSS defense products. This engineering vehicle was developed and produced in less than four years for the Turkish Armed Forces TISC, by the FNSS defense system. A contract to develop armored amphibious bulldozers was signed on March 10, 2009, between the Turkish Ministry of National Defense and the FNSS. The actual project began on June 15, 2009 producing 12 units at the end of 2013. The first unit was sent on January 11, 2013. Kunduz is dedicated to moving land, clearing terrain obstacles, cutting steep slopes and stabilizing river flow to facilitate river crossings for combat vehicles during Turkish Army's amphibious operations. Azmim, another name for Kunduz, has two crew members, an operator and a supervisor. Esmeem is equipped with a daylight camera system, night vision device, multi-use LED screen and air conditioning. The maximum speed is 45 km per hour. Two water jets mounted on the vehicle allow the amphibious bulldozer to make 360-degree rotating movements in the waters of strong currents. OS is amphibian, armored, tracked, at war designed for river bank preparation during river crossing missions. It is capable of carrying out bulldozers, rough assessments, excavations, transportation, and erosion operations. Compared to standard heavy-duty vehicles, OS has the ability to take ballast from the ground into the ballast tube, if necessary the vehicle is also able to remove the ballast tube at the end of the operation. On standard heavy-duty vehicles, the dozer blade is hydraulically operated while the vehicle is stable. However, at OS it was repaired for vehicles. With an adjustable hydraulic suspension system, the front of the OS can be shifted in a vertical axis. This capability allows the blade or ballast tube to come in contact with the ground and penetrate it. As a result, shoveling and plowing can be done more efficiently. This activity can also be done while the vehicle is moving. One of the most important and unique features of OS is its amphibious ability. It can be operated with a crew of two. In addition, OS is equipped with modern electronic systems such as day and night cameras, multifunction LCD monitors and AC systems. To provide amphibian capabilities, along with mine and ballistic protection requirements. The OS hull structure is made of ballistic aluminum. Its modern hydraulic system and power transmission enable vehicles to operate with higher maneuverability and operational performance. The OS power package consists of a full automatic transmission, coupled with a diesel engine. OS can go up to 45 km per hour on land. It can travel safely in streams at current speeds of up to 1.5 meters per second with 360 degrees maneuverability through its two water jets, placed at the rear on both sides of the vehicle. OS is produced as a development and local production project for FNSS. Today OS is used by Turkish Army forces in various missions and has proven combat in certain operations. Source, ArmyRecognition.com Thank you for watching my channel. This video is just an illustration, I hope you can understand it. Thank you my friend.